Good morning. You're watching the Financial News Network on FNNO.com. I'm Jeffrey Parrish, and here's what's in the news today, July 27th. The Wall Street Journal reports that New York Senator Schumer will ask Treasury Secretary Geithner to use Canucks's proposed $15 billion purchase of Canada's Nexen as leverage to open the Chinese market for U.S. companies. Also, Fiat CEO Marchione accused Volkswagen of fueling an automobile price war that is contributing to deep industry losses, promoting a Volkswagen executive to call for him to resign as head of Europe's top auto industry trade group. The Wall Street Journal also reports that the Justice Department and SEC are considering an examination of the retail industry for violations of anti-foreign bribery law after Walmart and other retailers have come forth with their own potential offenses, sources say. Reuters says that Amgen offered to acquire human genome sciences for $35 per share two years ago. But the preliminary $7 billion bid was rejected, according to sources. Last week, however, Human Genome did agree to be bought by GlaxoSmithKline for only $14.25 per share, or $3 billion. Bloomberg also reports that a Russian court ordered BP to pay TNKBP its venture with a group of billionaires $3.1 billion in damages over BP's failed tie-up with OAO Rosneft. Additionally, John Paulson may have lost $48.9 million on his hedge funds, stake in Nova Gold Resources, as the stock fell the most in over three years after Barrick Gold said its Donlin Gold joint venture with Nova Gold doesn't meet the company's investment criteria. Nova Gold is 13% owned by Paulson & Co., Bloomberg reports. For more updates, you can head over to FNNO.com or follow us on Twitter at FNN Online.